Sam, congratulations on your new deal. How are you feeling? Oh, I'm delighted. I'm obviously very happy that um, you know I've been here for two, two and a half years. So I think that the new deal reflects uh, the progress we've made working with Steve and Jez and all the other coaches along the way. So I'm obviously very happy. You mentioned working with Steve there. How have you enjoyed working with him and of course some great goalkeepers during your time at the Ames? Uh, I think that working with Steve has been really good. I think he's really helped my progression. I think for the year and a half I've been working with him that um, we've come a long way in terms of um, the way I play and what I need to do to be a professional goalkeeper and play for Lincoln. So I think with more work like that, hopefully one day we can we can get there. You're into your third year at the club now, second as a pro. How do you reflect on your time with the Imps so far? Well, it's been it's been up and downs, of course, but that's football. Um, I think at the start as a scholar, uh, I was a, I was very young and I didn't really know much about. Um, how to act and, and what to expect really from full-time football but I think especially last year um, I learned a lot just being around Steve and Alex and now obviously with Josh and Archie um, so I've learned a lot of things um, that will really help me in my career hopefully so um, yeah I mean especially last year with the, the good season we had um, I can I can use that experience to you know push on you mentioned, of course, the squad last year, getting to Wembley, such a great achievement. What was it like for you as a young player to be involved in that group? Yeah, of course, Wembley is somewhere that I've always wanted to play. Watching watching teams I've supported, teams that, you know, the best teams in the world play there. It's always been a, a dream to play there. Um, even though I didn't play, just, just being in the change rooms, going on the pitch with the fans was, was amazing. And hopefully one day we can, or I can go there again and, and play and win. So you've signed the deal three and a half years with the club, committing your future a bit longer term. What do you hope to get out of your time at the club during this deal? Well, of course, I want to be Lincoln's number one goalkeeper. I think that's always been the aim since I've joined the club. Um, and the best way I can do that is just by working hard every day. With Steve, Josh and Archie and, and the outfield players as well. I think the best way to do that is just by putting everything in every day, um, on and off the pitch, being as professional as I can. Um, and just learning different things all the time. So um, the aim is yeah to be Lincoln's number one, but you know there's a lot of things I need to do to get there, and I'm aware of that as well. It's not just a proud day for you, of course. Uh, a lot of people have helped you get here. Um, proud day for your family and for your friends, of course, as well. Yeah, of course. You know, my mum and dad were very happy when they found out. Um, um, I think that they've helped me a lot in the past, and I'm really grateful for, for what they've done for me. Um, and also like some old coaches I've had, um, you know, I think that my whole life wanting to be a professional footballer, you know, I've signed my first one and now I'm on my second one and there's a long way to go um, to where I want to be, but, you know, I'm on the right track, I think, so, and hopefully Lincoln can help my progression and, and, and get there in the end. You excited to get going again? Of course I am. Cheers, sir. Congratulations. No